Good morning, this is Francis from McCaffrey Crafts here in County Kerry in Ireland. And here are two uh, black torn shillelagh that I made um, over last weekend. Um, these are about like uh, about 19, 19 and a half inches in, the, in length. I'm not sure exactly, but close enough to that anyway. And they would be, you know, that would be maybe about 300 grams. This might be about 270, I think, or maybe it's the other way around. Uh, yeah, this one's the, the heavier piece as well. This looks like about an inch thick as well and they're usually like um, the way that i make them they're usually about like two inches by an inch and a three quarters or two inches thick or stuff like that and that gives you a good club at the top of the uh the, the shillelagh as well here you can see the uh the bark up close for those uh who are interested in knowing what uh, what real black turn looks like as you can see here this is made from one piece of wood um with mccaffrey crafts black torn shillelaghs we do not get a piece of wood and stick something on the top and call it a shillelagh this is what a real walking stick is look there's no joint there's nothing covered there's there's nothing like mysterious about this as well so um you know finding a number of these sticks can be quite difficult and over the years um, i've put a load of these these shorter little ones to the side and uh, over the next kind of uh, two months i suppose i'm going to 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 try to make more of uh, these type of uh, these type of sticks as well of course as my black drawn walking sticks and hiking sticks but um there seems to be a lot of interest in these sticks at the moment uh you know there's some tv shows and there's there's uh you know in, in pop culture as well and uh you know with uh with the, the star wars and uh, boba fett as well having his uh his sticks and learning about stick fighting and different things as well and uh, in county kerry in ireland um uh, the faction fighters were well known for fighting with two sticks they would have a shorter stick like this and they would have a longer stick as well so if you're you know this is an ideal gift for someone who has a background in irish heritage is interested in irish martial arts is interested in history and if you want to own a piece of ireland this literally is like this grew in irish soil like nutrients from the soil you know made this grow you can't get a more authentically Irish product than McCaffrey Crafts. Like, you know, we, we live in a world of fabricated products. You know, we live in a world of copies. We live in a world where people say they have an authentic shillelagh and it's not an authentic shillelagh. I am a professional. I know the difference between what is a real black torn shillelagh and what is a fake um, Frankenstein sticks, which I'm very vocal about. So uh, I do not make Frankenstein sticks. Uh, I'm very, very passionate about about my craft as as well I should be as well. You know, this is hard work, you know, like uh you guys you, you see these sticks online, you don't know the history of what I've gone through to, to get these sticks, uh which is uh which is pain, blood, sweat and tears. Um it's not fun going out in wintertime in the freezing cold, <laughs> going into the middle of a thorny bush trying to cut out these and uh, getting spiked and getting jabbed by the poisonous blackthorn bush uh but you know it's it's uh the, the things the things i do for for my craft as well um but uh there you have it if you're interested in these type of uh, uh black torn shillelaghs i have loads of them up on the website now i think i have 20 up and I'll, I'll probably try to get another 20 up before the end of the week and uh you know if you're looking for something uh unique um a great display piece a great talking piece great piece to, to have in the home then then this is this is what you need um as always thanks for watching and uh, thanks for supporting irish crafts and um, you know without you guys supporting irish crafts uh, we wouldn't have an industry and so that's actually um you know uh, i'm very uh, uh happy that uh, you have supported me through throughout the last few years uh bye-bye